Hey everyone, I'm Asha Kay, your tech guru, showing you how to use Pandora on your iPad. Pandora is a great application to have if you've never heard of it before and you are a music lover like me and constantly listening to music, this is the app for you. Also, if you're having something like a birthday party or a get together and you want constant music playing, this is what you need. It's an internet radio station. It's basically a free streaming music service. So first thing you have to do is install the Pandora application Go to the App Store, find it, search for it, and install it. It's free, it's really easy to use. So I've already installed the Pandora application. I'm going to go to my home screen. There's the Pandora application, you'll see it. It's just got a big P. You'll go into that. Now if you've never used Pandora before, first thing you have to do is create an account and sign in. Now I already have an account, I've signed in. All you have to do is use your email, password, create a username and a password, sign in, and away you go. Okay, so once you're in Pandora, you're going to want to start listening to music. And the basic premise of it is to create your own individual radio stations that are basically tailored to your music choices. So I've already got a few radio stations listed down the left-hand left side here. But we're going to find a new radio station from scratch. So for instance, if you like Carrie Underwood, she's a really great artist, very popular. You're going to go to the search box on the top left-hand side here and you're going to type in Carrie Underwood. Now as you're typing, it'll automatically come up with a selection of names. So Carrie Underwood is the first name that has come up. I'm going to click on that. And all of a sudden, it has created the Carrie Underwood radio station. So it starts playing. I'm just going to pause that. Now one of the great, app one of the great features of Pandora is clicking the thumbs up or thumbs down. As you can see on top here, there's a thumbs down or thumbs up. So I'm going to click the thumbs up. What that does is refines what Pandora searches when you type in an artist. The great thing about Pandora is when you type in, for instance, Carrie Underwood, Pandora automatically finds a whole range of artists exactly like Carrie Underwood and creates the station for you. So if I was to skip to the next song, you'd find Taylor Swift, very similar to Carrie Underwood. Um, now it's not just artists you can type in and create a station, it's also individual songs. Same exact concept. Type in a song, Pandora finds similar songs and there you have a new station. Now the other thing I want to show you how to do in Pandora is to delete a station. So if you're sick of listening to Carrie Underwood, you listen to it every day, that's it, you want to find a new artist, all you have to do, swipe it like that and click on the delete icon. It's gone. So there you go, that is how you use Pandora on your iPad. If you have any questions or comments, type them below, and I will see you next time. I'm Asha Kay.